Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Floss, back again with another video. And today we're gonna take a look at the Nightcore P20iX 4000 Lumen Tactical Flashlight. Now you can pick this one up on Amazon. I'll throw the link up in the description. The price on this one, 120 bucks. Now on a side note, a lot of people have been asking me to make a what's in my EDC bag video. And this is one of my favorite EDC products. Now, if you don't know what EDC means, that just means everyday carry. This is a flashlight that I carry every single day. Now, not only is this a dope flashlight, it could literally save your life. And I'm gonna talk about that in a minute. All right, so let's go through the specs real quick. Now, this is a high lumen tactical flashlight. The Nightcore P20iX burst out 4,000 lumen light that can reach up to 241 yards. Easy to operate with four levels of brightness and a strong glass breaking bezel for emergencies. Now this is the part right here that can save your life. Strobe ready. Simply press and hold the strobe mode switch on the tail cap to access the strobe mode at any time. Now this is a non-linear strobe pattern that causes enhanced dizzying effects, highly effective for diffusing a tent situation. Now this is USB Type-C rechargeable, fast recharge the P20iX via its USB Type-C port and enjoy 30 minutes of 4000 lumen turbo and 350 hours runtime on low. Now this is ready for duty. Okay, so it's IP68 waterproof and it has impact protection and it has the uh, tactical holster which is compatible for duty belts and all of the Mali systems. Now inside the box, you're gonna get the holster, the charging cable, a lanyard clip and a LumenTac organizer. Now, check this out. This is what I mean by, <laughs> hold on, let me pull this out. This is what I mean by this flashlight could save your life the non-linear strobe pattern. Now I'm gonna tell y'all a quick story. Matter of fact, I gotta show y'all something real quick. Let me go to the comments. This is what <laughs> this is what started this story. So I happen to be reading the comments just for fun and watch this. Okay, look at this comment right here. Now I'm gonna pull this up. <laughs> okay, it says, um, somebody says, I want an extremely high lumen flashlight for self-defense. Is 4,000 lumens hard to get to? Somebody said, yes. Okay, this is somewhat close to self-defense range. It will hinder any attacker. Uh, let me see, uh, hinder any attacker, yada, yada, yada. But this is the part that got me. No human with naked eyes to continue looking at this light. All right, no human with the naked eyes. So here's the story. <laughs> now, the other day, I'm in my house sipping some Hennessy. I'm a little bit tipsy. So I decided to try this out because I hate to make claims without trying something out in real life. So now in the comment, it said from 10 to 15 feet away. So I'm sitting like I am right now. Now, I don't know if this is gonna translate to a YouTube video, but watch this. Now, I don't wanna even look at this, watch this. Look directly at your screen. I don't know if y'all can see this, but from behind the camera, okay? <laughs> this flashlight, it is impossible to look at that strobe for longer than one to two seconds without getting dizzy. Now, here's the funny story. As I was drunk, I shined this in my light, in my eyes like this. Bro, I kid you not, not only did I get dizzy, I almost threw up. And I was laughing so hard because I've been using this flashlight for a while, but I never shined it directly in my own eyeballs like that. But after reading that comment, I decided to try it out and I'm gonna go on record right now, okay? It is impossible to look at this light, strobing like this, without getting dizzy. Now, if somebody's drunk, this is perfect for, you're hanging out at the bars and all that, and you got that one drunk person harassing you, harassing you while you're inside your car. If you flash this at somebody, they're gonna get dizzy. I, I don't know if they're gonna get completely dizzy, especially if they're drunk, they're definitely gonna get dizzy. But it's very disorientating. Like, even right now, once I flash this and I take it away, I cannot read anything that's on this box. So this flashlight could easily save your life for two reasons. One, for the strobe light, not to mention, it does have the glass breaking capabilities. So you're in a car accident and you get pinned in and you need to break that window. If you grab this and you hit that window, it's definitely gonna break, 100%. All right, so let's go ahead and unbox this one and see what it is. First things first, shout out to White Shoes. She got the day off. Okay, so this is the Nightcore P20iX, extreme performance. Now, y'all know holiday season is right around the corner. This is the perfect gift for that guy that got everything. And the perfect gift, fellas, give to your lady, okay? Everybody should have one of these in their car. That's actually why I bought this one. I'm giving it to Amaya for her car. I got mines. I keep one in the house, one in my EDC bag, and one in the car. Okay, let's see. Uh, rechargeable lithium ion battery, 5,000 milliamps. Let's go ahead and pop this one open. 
Here's what you get inside. Okay, now this is gonna be the, <laughs> the P20IX. Okay, you got a little troll sticker, plug it and file it. Let's see what else you get, a little poison for the trolls. Let me go ahead and save that. And this should be the holster. Okay, of course you got the usual books and shit, plug them and follow them. Okay, you got the lanyard. Okay, so if you wanna put this on and let this hang off, you can do it like that. I put it right on the bottom, let it hang. USB A to USB Type-C charging cable. Okay. And the little clip right here. Now, if you wanna rock this on your waist, it does come with the bung, just like that. Now, when I'm riding my bike, I like to just throw this right on my waist and rock out just like this. Now, I don't rock a duty belt anymore, so, you know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna talk about that. But um, this is perfect for all of that, okay? And then one for your battery. All right, so that's basically it. This is one of those simple and effective products. Let's see if this one has any juice. No, this one we're gonna have to charge up, but mine is fully charged up. So here's how it works. One button on the bottom, you press it, there's your light. Now I'm gonna take this outside so you can see exactly how bright it is, but you got a bunch of different modes. So this is one level of brightness. That's the second level, third level, fourth level, and 4,000 lumens. Now, <laughs> I'm sitting behind the camera. This is blinding. I did. If you're looking at this, it is straight blinding. Watch this. Let's see if shoes can, let's see if shoes can pass. Oh, matter of fact, let's see if shoes can pass the test. All right, first of all, we gotta hit shoes with the theme music. Ladies and gentlemen, late, but still great. White shoes is back in the building. I love my white shoes. I love my white shoes. I love my white, white shoes. shoes. Calm down. Now, cat's eyes are more sensitive. Let's see if this affects shoes at all. Yeah, see now, cats, cats, cats are savages because, you see, shoes don't care about that. <laughs> Let me see if I get, shoes, check, check this out. Hello, the strobe, let me hit the strobe. Nothing? All right, yeah, this is, this is cat proof, all right? So if you're getting attacked by an angry cat, do not pull this out. But anyway, back to how it works. So you hit the button on the bottom to power it on. Then you hit this button, that'll cycle between the different levels of brightness. Turn it off. Now, if you wanna hit the strobe, all you have to do is press the button while it's off, and it automatically starts strobing. So you just press the button. This is why it says, this is why I say, this is perfect for self-defense. You got this in your hand, somebody's running up on you. You just hit them with the strobe like, you're a bro, back up, back up, back up. Now, honestly, I shoes, skedaddle. Honestly, I use this for a few other reasons not particularly for self-defense, but for fat reasons. Number one, okay, <laughs> number one, when I order Uber Eats, for some reason they have a hard time finding my address. So every time I follow them on the app, and when I see them getting close to my block, I just come outside, and when I see the car coming down the block, I just go like this a couple of times, and they always see me. That is one use for this. Now, another time I use this is when I travel. I always take this with me when I travel because you never know when you're gonna need a nice bright flashlight in some of these hotel rooms. Okay, nice bright flashlight. Let me get let me get some uh, extra brightness, look at that. Nice bright flashlight, way brighter than your cell phone flashlight. But when I travel back to JFK and I call my Uber, it's always a struggle trying to get to your Uber. So I always leave in the notes. I say, look, I'm gonna be at the end of the, the end of the ramp, look for the strobe. And when I see my Uber coming, I always go like this, and they can see me, okay? Not to mention, if your car breaks down, okay? If your car breaks down and you got no power, so you can't put in your hazards, you don't got any lights at all, maybe on the highway or close to the side of the highway, cars come in 50, 60 miles an hour, you will get wrecked. Okay, this could save you. You see the cars coming up, just go like this, and they'll see you. Wait till the next car coming up, go like this. Now, one thing you can't, the strobe doesn't stay on. You're gonna have to physically press it. So you can't just put it on the back of your car and leave it like this. But if you want to, you could just turn the flashlight on, put it on the back of your car, and leave it like that. And people are gonna see you. But if you're using 4,000 lumens, you're only gonna do 30 minutes, so you're not gonna wanna do that. What I like to do is just use the strobe manually, okay? Just like that, bang. <laughs> I didn't know cats, I didn't know cat, yo, cat's vision is crazy, yo, look at that. Shoes do not care, <laughs> she don't care. Anyway, 
this is my favorite EDC flashlight. Now I wanna take it outside so y'all can see exactly how bright it is. And we'll do a little comparison to the flashlight that most of y'all carry in your pocket, your cell phone flashlight. So we're gonna see exactly how much more brighter this one is than your cell phone. So let's hit the streets. All right, so one more thing I forgot to mention. Now as far as charging this up, it is water resistant. So you got the little flap right here. You just open this up and you got a USB type C charging slot. Now, once you plug it in, you do have an LED. It's gonna be blinking to let you know that it's actually charging up. All right, so I'm outside in the park. This is the darkest part that I could find. And I'm gonna show you the difference between a cell phone flashlight and the night core. So first, let me pull out my iPhone flashlight. Okay, there's an iPhone flashlight. That's what it looks like if you're looking around. Okay, now let's bring out the night core. We're gonna start off with the first level of brightness. Okay, let's increase it now. Second level of brightness. Third level of brightness. Fourth level. And fifth level. Look at this. Basically light up the whole park. Now I'm gonna turn it off. See the difference? Look how bright this is. Now here's how that strobe would look. This is what it would look like <laughs> if somebody strobed you with this. It's gonna look just like this. Look at that. All right, so your car breaks down somewhere and you need to flag incoming traffic. People can definitely see you. All right, so this is super bright. All right, so check this out. You ever drop something in the dark and you're trying to use your phone's flashlight to find it? Here's how it looks. All right, here's my phone flashlight. This would be me trying to find something. Now I'm gonna show you the difference. Let's pull out the night core, 4,000 lumens. Look at the difference. Super bright. Bang. You'd easily be able to find your keys or your wallet, whatever you dropped. All right, so check this out. Say your car breaks down on the highway and you need to get flagged down. Now I'm all the way at the end of the park and I put the flashlight up all the way down at the other end and look how bright that light is. So let's walk down. You can clearly see that light. So if you was driving and somebody had that light on, Look how bright that is. Lighting up the whole park. So this is how it would look if you was driving or walking up on somebody and they had that light. You could not see behind it. As I'm getting closer and closer, watch this. All of that super light <laughs> coming from this little flashlight. Pretty sick. All right, so one last test. Now this happens to me a lot. You ever drop something by your car and you can't find it, so you pull out your cell phone flashlight and you're going like this, trying to find it. This light does seem pretty bright, okay? But let's try the flashlight instead. Watch the difference between 4,000 lumens, look at that. 
easily see everything. I can actually see through my tinted windows. Let's try that with the phone flashlight. I'm curious. Okay, even pressed up against the glass. Watch this. Turn on the phone flashlight. Okay, press it up against the glass. You see? Can't see anything through it. Now let's try the flashlight one more time. Through these 5% tint, look how bright that is. Pretty dope. All right, so overall, on a scale of one to 10, I'm giving the Nightcore P20iX a major, major, major go. This is a must have product for me, and this is my favorite EDC flashlight. The build quality is excellent. It feels premium, rugged, and it has that tactical look to it. It's IP68 water resistant. Okay, so it's gonna be good in any situation. You got the glass breaking bezel. That could save your life. Okay, it recharges with a USB type C, so you ain't gotta worry about batteries. You got five different levels of brightness, including 4,000 lumens. Do y'all see how bright this shit is? And of course, my favorite feature, the non-linear strobe. This could definitely save your life. Anyway, this is the Nightcore P20iX. Comes with the holster too. All right, makes it easy to carry. Hit me up in the comments. Let me know what y'all think about this one. And let me know if y'all want to see some more of my EDC products. I'll show you one more. Okay, I got this one right here. Shout out to my pops. He blessed me with this one. <laughs> little stun, a little stun light. Just in case you gotta get the zapping, you know what I'm saying? Now, I never tested this one out in real life, so I don't know how effective this stun is gonna be. But this is a good, a good, um, <laughs> this is a good, what's the word I'm looking for? Intimidation. This is a good intimidation weapon. Now you arguing with somebody, okay, and you pull this out, and they hear that zap, they might wanna think twice about approaching you. Now, again, I never really tested it out. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna do it to shoes like that, but. <laughs> ah, one of these days, I will test it out on one of my friends. Maybe I'll pay them a buck and see if they can take a quick snap. But this is another little EDC item. I'll leave the link for this up in the description. I think this one is about 40, 50 bucks. Again, just for intimidation. Hit me up in the comments. Let me know what y'all think about this. Shout out to everybody rocking with me on Facebook, Foursquare, Twitter, Google Plus. Shout out to all the Google gangsters. I see y'all holding down that Facebook page. Shout out to everybody hitting me up on Boxer. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with me on Instagram. Y'all know that's where I'm at full time, 100% full throttle. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with the new stream on Sundays. Y'all already know, stream gangsters on deck. Get your drinks ready. No meat boys allowed. Special shout out to everybody following me on Snapchat, Flossy underscore Carter, that's where I'm at. And a special shout out to the notification squad. I see y'all in the comment section early. Hashtag salute. Oh yeah, one more thing. I almost forgot. Fellas, ladies, say it with me. All y'all haters, all y'all trolls, close your eyes. And picture me rolling. It's your boy Floss of Mac. Peace. Enterprise. Spock here. Spock won the beam up. Everybody in the world uses technology. And if you're gonna buy some of that technology, you gotta understand certain things. Subscribe to Flossy Carter. He does reviews of all the latest technology. The iPhones, the iPads, the Galaxies, the Samsungs, whatever the fuck. The Beats by that doctor guy. And he puts his kitty cat in the videos too for you something to look at. You know, I'm an animal lover, so I like that shit. 
So make sure you hit the subscribe button, the Flossy Carter on the YouTube, the follow button on the Insta face, and the like button on the face look. Because if you don't, we're going to have a fucking problem here. A bad one. Now hit the fucking subscribe button.